it's time for our very last Easter activity today. Um, so this one is for uh, all ages, including the toddlers. So I think this is something that anybody can have fun doing um, and that even the littlest hands can do. And that is So this is really easy to make. All you need is a toilet paper tube, some scissors, and some glue. And then of course, some paper and paint uh, to actually stamp with. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and show you what my stencils look like. I've gone ahead and made some toilet paper tube stencils. And here is one of them right here. Um, so all I did was I cut a toilet paper tube into three pieces. You want your pieces to be about the same size because you want all of the edges to line up. Um, so once you have that done, you're going to go ahead and get your paper and your paint and start stenciling. And I'll be back to show you that in just a minute. Okay, so what I have done, um, as you can see on my original example, you can be really simple with this. You can get really abstract. I think this was one of my older kids who did this last year. Um, but what I decided to do this time is I went ahead and I drew a little scene on a piece of paper. Um, so I have just some grass, a tree, a sun, whatever your kid wants to put on the paper. And then I went ahead and I put some paint on a plate. I have a uh, blue, purple, and pink paint. Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take my paintbrush and I'm not really gonna mix them. I'm just gonna kind of swoosh them around a little bit. I'll show you what I mean. So there you go. They're not super mixed, they're just there. And that's the end of my paintbrush. I don't need this anymore. So I'm gonna put this away. And now I'm gonna take my bunny stencil, the flat side. So if you can see, I have one side here that this isn't very flat, so this isn't gonna work as a good stencil. This side is really nice and flat, so that'll stamp nicely. So I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna dump it. I'll dunk it into my paint, kind of move it around a little bit. That's okay if it mixes, that's fine. And then I'm gonna put it on my paper. So let's see. There we go. Just like that. And I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna get a lot in there. When you really rub it around, that's how it picks up a lot of paint. I'm gonna put it right on there and press good and hard. Kind of wiggle it a little bit. And there you go. There's my bunny. And that's as simple as that. Um, you can you do it however many times you want. You can put 12 bunnies, you can put one bunny. It's all up to you. Um, and you end up with a beautiful piece of Easter art. Um, so get creative with it, do what you want. Um, I'll be coming around to the Lambeth folks with uh, paint, paper plates, and everything you need to do this craft in just a little bit. I'll see you then. Bye.